Hello everybody. Let's talk about a term that we are all heard of but we don't actually know for sure. What is meant by pre-traumatic and what is meant by post-traumatic? So for that we'll have to draw the pharyngeal arches. Let's number them from 1 to 6. The first one is there, second, third, fourth and sixth. You know there were six arches but we lost the fifth arch and there are only five arches remaining. From the first we also have the maxillary process as you can see there it is projecting upwards from the first arch. Each arch has its own nerve. The nerve of the first arch is the mandibular nerve. The nerve of the second arch is the facial nerve. The third arch we have the glossopharyngeal nerve. The fourth arch we have the superior laryngeal nerve and the sixth arch we have the recurrent laryngeal nerve. Right? So we have these nerves and now we come to the term which is pre-traumatic. So sensory branches which are given off by these arch nerves to the previous arch, these are form the pre-traumatic nerves. And pre-traumatic nerves in the adult or in the post-embryonic or post-birth appear only in remnants of the first and the second arches. So let's see. The mandibular nerve in the picture as you can see there is giving off a branch to the maxillary process which is the previous arch and that branch is the maxillary nerve that forms the pre-traumatic nerve. What about the second arch? The second arch nerve is the facial nerve and that gives off a branch called the cauda tympani which goes into the preceding arch which is the first arch, right? So that forms the pre-traumatic nerve of the first arch. Let's zoom in and see what they are, what it actually means, right? So trema is a word which means cleft. So you can see from the black arrows that are marked over there, those are the two clefts between the first two arches. So pre-traumatic means above the cleft and it refers to any nerve which passes along the lower border of the arch above. It is a nerve which passes above the cleft, pre-traumatic, all right? And post-traumatic obviously means below the cleft or after the cleft. So it refers to the nerve which passes along the upper border of the arch below, post-traumatic. So when we come to that, we have the first cleft over there. So the pre-traumatic nerve of the first arch is the maxillary nerve, the nerve which passes above the cleft, right? And the post-traumatic nerve will be the mandibular nerve because it is the nerve which is passing below the cleft. What about the second arch? We have the cleft over there, right? So the pre-traumatic nerve will be the nerve passing above the cleft, that is the cauda tympani, and the post-traumatic nerve will be coming after the cleft, which is the facial nerve, all right? So the pre-traumatic nerve of the first arch is the maxillary of the second arch is the cauda tympani, right? So that is some entrance questions for you. Thank you so much.